I've had to believe that my body is my instrument and I take it everywhere I go and I had to have that mindset shift in the last few years because what was happening was as a Bollywood actress you're just so used to so much production value and um, drama around you in the process of filmmaking that actually I was losing a sense of just that innate desire to dance. Going to India to be an actress was such a soul-searching experience. Mumbai is New York times gazillion. It's packed. It has all levels of society. There's garbage everywhere. <laughs> but it's got this spirit which just keeps people going. It taught me a lot. It taught me a lot about grit, about resilience and about identity. I think that was the biggest part of my journey. As an actress, also what I was realizing was that I was playing the archetype very, in, my, in a few of my films, I was playing that heroine figure who has the privileged background, looks nice, dances well, but that's not the reality for most women in India. So it was really time for me to take a step back. I believe very strongly in certain issues, I believe in human rights and I'm very outspoken about them and often that's gotten me into trouble because I'm deviating from the norm which is shut up and smile, do your job, dance around a tree and be happy that you're dancing around the tree. So I think, you know, right now, you know, traversing the Indian Australian identity for me means a lot of responsibility. Say, my brother always says, you always take the hard road. Why do you do it? Why do you make your life harder for yourself? But it's, it's the joy of doing what I do. If I can do it, I must. And there, I think there's a reason for everything. There's a reason that I went to a leftist law school and had social justice interests and then became an actress. I mean, if I can't marry those two together, then there's a problem. Hi, this is Pallavi Shada and I'm hanging out in Brooklyn, New York. I'm a convict. I'm a convict, yaar. I like to tell you that I'm a convict. You know, I'm a convict. I've been telling everybody for years I'm a convict and today they will believe me. Mate, like, I was a convict for a day. Out in Brooklyn, it was sick, man. It was so sick. Felt like, it felt like I was back home, yeah? I'm a convict. It's been a fantastic experience today getting to know my fellow convicts out in a place called Brooklyn. And uh, I traversed the East River, it was very exciting. Oi, mate, I'm a convict, yeah?